I've got one mission and one mission only. Find the old treasures and get them to new vintage lovers' homes. We here at Jolie Flips Vintage pick through every location we visit with a fine tooth comb. Be it thrift shops, garage or estate sales, vintage markets, or antique malls, if there are secondhand luxury pieces lurking around, we will surely find them. So pull up a seat, get cozy, and Jolie flip with us. All right, guys. So we are at the red, white, and blue thrift store with Adam. And uh, it's just down the street of the hospital. For those of you who've been following me on social media, my dad get, did get called for a kidney transplant. So um, we are just down the street taking a break during my lunch hour also, because I'm also trying to work as a nurse. Uh, and this is a cash only store. So anyway, long story short is he's doing really well. The kidneys are taking almost right away. It's a great kidney. We're gonna grab this cart. We're gonna see what they have available today. This is our therapy for <laughs> stress. So we wanted to take you along with us. I don't know that Adam's ever been here. Have you been here, Adam? Oh, this is a nice one. I kind of like this. All right, guys, it's kind of Southwestern. <laughs> and then there's this one that's embroidery. That's real gorgeous. Wow. Oh, I might pick that up. I really like the blues on there. $4.99. I'll check it to make sure it's okay. This one, yeah, it's not that cold not here cold. right now. So I don't want to get anything like that. It'll be hard for me to resell here. All right. I like to always check the planters because sometimes the flower arrangements are inside good things, you know, like Batosi and stuff. It's kind of cool. They used a um, English breakfast leaf tea tin. Well, this is kind of cool. It's like tooled leather, dull wick designs. Wait a minute. It's $5.99. It's a jewelry box, but it's a cool one. It's a tooled leather. I don't know if it's real, but let's, you know, let's get that because I kind of need it for myself. I don't know if I'm going to resell that yet. Not sure yet. Ooh. These I kind of leave behind. I have a lot of them. They are glass. The Greek key uh, used to be very popular, but it's not lately. This is good. It was $12.99. Made in Mexico, Latin America. That vase is nice. For $7.99. It was $12.99. Let's pop it in here and we might get that because I really love Mexican stuff. I'm seeing really cool things, so let's keep a lookout. All right, so I'm seeing a couple cool stuff. I don't know what the colors are. $14.99 for that's a lot. Well, look at these though. These are $35. I'm gonna put these in my car just to see but they're worth later. Well, we want to take them just in case other people come and they really want it. Let's take that one too. There's a couple more that I'm gonna grab. And I know you're probably thinking like, is she really gonna pay $35 each one? I would. I'm a pay up type person if it's worth it. Totem poles have become very popular for me to resell, especially wood ones. But this one is chipped and it's resin. And the quality is just really not there. This is cool. This is chipped also, but it is stone. It's not that chipped. I think it's, it might be intentional, but I like it. So that would sell really well on whatnot. And there's another one of these back here. This is in great condition and that's also 35. So we'll go ahead and grab these. I like them. There's a butterfly. Here. Kind of like that for $1.99. It's like maybe a project piece, but it's really neat. So we'll grab that. I don't know where Adam went. <laughs> this is a milk glass planter. It's $7.99. It's a little much for me to want to purchase, but these do sell well for me. But I there's not a lot of room for profit for me for that. It's a nice planter with the mosaic tile. And then there's some squirrels here mainstays isn't that um isn't that a walmart brand it's cool too but that's resin um this 
sun is really cool. I'm like really digging. Oh, I'm digging this. I don't really want the flower. I mean, I know it's resin, but isn't that a really cool vase for $4.99? I like anything with the sun and the moon and things like that. All right, lots of figurines here. I don't see anything. I always love the precious moments, but they don't resell for me. And I'm not very good with knowing what does sell, like what's special, which ones are special uh, with the precious moments. That's kind of a cool clown, but I, I don't want to pay $7.99 for them. Although clowns are becoming popular for me. Also, what else? What about this is $14.99. Secretary, 19... 100% Secretary District, 1969. Oh, she's really cute. She's pottery, terracotta. And she might be blowing a whistle or something, but isn't she really neat? Oh, she's chipped at the bottom, though. I don't... It's like right in the front. She might be Jim Shore. Maybe. How much is she? Oh, she's broken back there. She might have had wings. Yeah, because she has a halo, so the wings are broken off. And then this one. All right. I don't pick up um, Willow Tree anymore. <laughs> I couldn't even remember the name of it. Oh, she's cool. I did sell this before with a blue dress. And there's like a whole set of her. Look more ten dollars is a little much it's a little much this is nice but it's 25 dollars and likely made in china but it's nice oh look at a little bird adam for 2.99 the bird alone is cute for resale 2.99 we'll grab that oh there's some dogs over here did you see do you like it in here? Isn't it great? Yeah, just a heads up though, there's a bunch of sick children in the back. So really? They have, they have colds and stuff? They coughing nonstop. Oh, we'll wait till they pass. We're trying not to get my dad sick with the, um, you know, with the transplant. So she's real cute. Let's see if she's chipped anywhere. Look at him. <laughs> oh, she's cute for $5 oh, sitting on a stone. We'll get her. She's kind of sensitive. <laughs> I'll walk around outside a little bit. Oh, okay. I will go back there, but I'm gonna wait till they they pass. So we'll get some of these dogs here that don't have prices on them. Let's see how much she is. Three ninety nine. So likely that's three ninety nine too. Scotty dog. I thought they were salt and pepper shakers. There's a little paint mess at the top, but it's okay. This one's adorable with the cats. It's probably made in China. Three ninety nine. Mm, I don't like the blue. I don't like it. Oh, um, Shia Yi. Okay, cool. Let's see. Oh, this planter is real cool. These planters always sell work pretty well for me. The older, the better. It's five ninety nine. We'll grab that too. Oh, we're getting. We are getting pretty lucky today. So, all right. This one's a candle. A little candle boy. Uh, I think he's cute as a candle for $2.99. Lots of great pickups today. He's a little scuffed in the front, but we can deal with that. He's a bat. He's a bat and he's signed. It's weird though, really creepy with those kind of blue opaque eyes. These don't resell for anything. These are molds. I see them all the time. I'll we'll skip it. Here's some ducks. $3.99. I never pick up ducks anymore. I'm sorry if you want them and you're going to message me like, I wanted those. Well, I'm going to leave them because they don't, they don't do well for me. This is probably formalities. Yes. The thing about formalities is it's always really pretty, but there's so many of them, I think. And maybe that's why they don't resell well, but it's always very nice. I personally love the quality. It's always some kind of thick, you know, ceramic. Look at this, you guys. Whoa, I bet you this glows. Check that out. Whoa. That's a different kind of glass. That's different. Let's grab it. Let's say we're getting pretty lucky. 
I don't know about those $35 ones. I'd have to look it up. Um, this is a cool mushy, but I believe it's from Target. But still cool. Put him here. No, we'll put him back to where he was. Um, a perfume bottle for five dollars. If nothing is broken, we will pick that up because perfume bottles are really good for me lately. Oh, I thought those were old. It has a little bit of an optic, but I always look for like extreme, extreme optic. Oh, look at this mold, and there's two of them, so that's nice. Some people really do love these kind of molds. I do resell them pretty well. And then we'll grab the one back there, unless someone wants it. Okay, really great that there's two of them. Okay, I mean, look at this, you guys. He's super old. It says, made in Japan confused about this guy he's like a really he's probably missing a top but I don't know he could be like a planter I don't know he's got a lot of crazing um, I don't pick up the shoes but there's an elephant over here I have these I have these they're like aren't they called Majolica it's eight bucks so we're gonna skip that Oh my gosh, where have I been all these days? Oh, you guys, stop it. Jeez, look at this Reuven. That is thick. Is it Reuven? It's sprayed. It's sprayed. It's $10. Oh, I almost dropped it. I don't know if it's a Reuven. 10 bucks. Reuven is usually... Sorry, ma'am. <laughs> Reuben is usually, oh, I don't know he is. I don't know if I should leave that, but I will. I'll leave it because it, it looks like a Reuben, but it's too thick. I don't know. I don't know much about it. What's that back there? Oh, use this bottle. Federal law forbids sale or reuse of this bottle. Really? That is milk glass. So we get in the front of it. We'll grab it. Because we're gonna use it for resale purposes. <laughs> so alright, look at this. Oh, I don't know, it's confusing. Is it $7.99 or $19.99? Either way. Oh, I feel like we should start right here. We just start, it's getting a little crowded, so let's look. Let's dig. Today's a good day here. Look at this. This is a different type of $5.99. This is different. I don't understand it. It's definitely cut crystal. Okay, some decanters. People are always asking me for old bottles. This looks like an old bottle, yeah. Federal law prohibits. Ooh, we're gonna have to grab that. That is neat. Okay, it's like the universe said, Sam, you have a lot of stress. Let's make you happy. This is black glass. Wow. Please don't be a lot of money. It's not. We'll grab that. $3.99. Oh my god, it's like a grab everything day. Oh, I don't want to break anything. Let me put some clothes down. Okay. And then there's a really cool picture here. Wow. Look at the glaze on it. Oh, $3.99? Get out of here. We're totally picking this up. What's happening today? <laughs> this looks a little modern. Yeah, I think it's Avon. It's Avon. I'm attracted to red. It's flash. Wow, what? Is that a hookah? Yeah. This is a bottle. And it's a nice grape bottle decanter. It's just missing a cork. So we will grab that for $4.99. Put things down slowly. What else? This is crazy. It's like Treasureville. Adam's like, oh, I'm going to wait outside because he could see that I'm getting lucky. And he's just like, you know what? That's neat, Sam. We're just, like I said, we're just having so much stress that so this is amazing. This is a nice old bottle, I think. I don't know if it's old. It doesn't feel old. 
This one feels old, looks old. Bottles are getting really popular these days. I kind of like the Art Deco design on that one. Grab it. Looks like maybe somebody had a collection of bottles. So, which is good to our advantage. Okay, and people do ask me a lot for decanters lately. So, we'll look, maybe we could pick up this one. Is that, what is that? You guys know it. Is it called a Wexel pattern? I don't know, but I don't have any and I like this one. Let me just think about it. I don't know anything about, this one's nice too. I feel like I should pick up some of them. I don't know. Let's see if there's any really good ones. Uh, you guys are probably gonna be like, why didn't you pick it up, Sam? They're only $3.99. But I feel like I don't really want big things. I'll grab that one, because I don't know if that's the original. Stop, or for, oh, there's a big chip in it. This is what I mean. I'm a little worried about picking things up like that, so. All right, let's keep looking. Let's skip that, and then maybe you guys can let me know in the comments what your opinion is on those. Like, how do I know what to pick it up? <laughs> pick up. If you know, let me know. I really love hearing you guys. This one's got little penguins in his body. It's ten dollars. I'm not gonna pick it up because his nose is chipped. Um, is that a bottle? Yeah, Carlton glass. It says juice on it. Three nine nine missing the top. Maybe I should pick that up. I don't know. There's one here. It's pretty old. With the flower on it. For three ninety nine, it's really scuffed. These two bottles, I'm not sure about. All right, maybe I'm making a mistake. I don't know. I'm just so overwhelmed, right? There's so many really good things. This little bud vase this made in taiwan look at this this is a deer decanter produced and handmade painted in italy what is the price on this that cork is really bad but you know this is really badly chipped it's just really neat though i bet you we can really clean that up Find out what the price is on it. That needs a really, that needs a bath. <laughs> Here's a Tweety thing. I don't know. I don't know. Lennox, little heart face that's very modern. Anything else? Look at this. $5.99. Oh my goodness today. Oh my goodness today. Look at this prismatic thing here. Oof, almost dropped it. We shall put it down. We will put it down, but look at this. Oops, sorry, sir. Oh, you guys, this is an actual controlled bubble perfume glass, and he's not broken. His tail's a little rough. He's $7.99. Look, it's a perfume bottle. Is his mouth broken? Oh, yeah. His mouth is slightly broken. See it? I mean, I want it anyway, and because it's not even that big of a deal. I know it's glass, but it's just really cool. Maybe they'll give me a discount because it's broken. I usually don't pick up glass that's broken though, but he's got a broken head. Oh, wow. All right, um, I'm just looking around. This is a cool one. It's $4.99. I've never seen milk glass like that. I don't know if I want to pay five bucks, but I might. <laughs> I like because it's different, you know? Any bottles down there? No. This is a bubble. Mm. I have to really clean this. I don't know. I, honestly, guys, it feels really cheap, even though it's bubble glass. And people always tell me to pick up bubble glass. But I think that's modern, so... Holy bits. We don't want anything else here, right? I'm sure I'm missing something, you guys. <laughs> I'm sure I am. Sometimes you gotta look between the plates. I'm not going to. I'm a little bit in a rush. This is my lunch break from work, so I have to go back and talk to patients. This has a chip on it, or I would pick that up, because I really do love honey. 
Um, let's see, lots of Wedgwood there. Always looking for some mid-century modern ashtrays. This might be a lid. That's a lid to a jar. This looks like old, but maybe not. Let's see. Oh, hand-painted made in Spain, TJ Maxx. Oops. I did not break it, I promise. So much glass. <laughs> um, <laughs> look at that one back there. This is an egg. Well, this might be made in Italy. $5.99 for it. I don't know, it's numbered. Easter's coming. I wonder if this is Italian. I don't know. This is an apothecary jar. <sighs> I don't know if I should pick that up. I just had a really bad experience with eggs. Like picking up eggs and I'm not selling. Oh my though, that is Lucite. You guys, that's a big Lucite candle holder. Look, $5.99, oh gosh. Look at this owl. Windstone Editions. Look at his eyeballs. He's so cool. $7.99 for the eyeball. Yeah, I'm gonna pay for that. Kinda cool. Put him here slowly. Oh, first of all, we're gonna pick up this Ikebana thing for $1.99. That's Ikebana. What? This place is like score after score today. It's like a little creamer, maybe? For $1.99, I really like his face. He's got crazing, but it's cool. Grab him. <laughs> what about candles? We're looking for Value Spa. Those resell pretty well. And it's during the time that I'm okay with selling candles where it's not going to be super hot. Oh, look at him. Top collection. Look at the... They're so cute. Not for $7.99, but that's cute. This, what kind, this might be in a Cabana vase too. really cool I don't know it's weird it's different Lord of the Rings um any candles uh, I don't want to be stuck with candles I, I have a lot of them so let's just move on look at this guy one cup oh it's my world market look at this Favreau glass thing it's modern very cheap and chipped up real bad right there. Um, it's kind of cool. Accents with the dragonfly. It's resin. Again, it feels very cheap. Sometimes you have to touch things, you know? Look at these candles, though. These look cool. Jerusalem. Um, these are neat. Made in Israel. Look at this one. Wow. Why is there no price? Probably this one, $2.99. These are really cool. $2.99. Just, I don't know if I should pick them up. I've never seen candles like that. I don't know. No, I won't do it. We can't pick up everything that looks cool. We have to know if it resells. And today I'm not going to look up anything. I'm just going to buy, I'm <coughs> sorry, buy them. I'm just going to buy them. Look at this. <laughs> this is just kind of cool. I've stopped picking up those avocado bases. I have them. If you want them, if you need them, let me know because I have them. If you're having a hard time finding it. These are kind of cool. They're like fairy lamps. Heart-shaped fairy lamps. It'd be really nice if we found like a Burmese fairy lamp or maybe like a Burmese, <laughs> a pern, which I am getting very close to bidding on on eBay for $800. And that's Polish pottery right here. So we're going to pick that up. It's a Polish pottery mug. And the handles are intact for $2.99. Uh-oh, wait. Uh-uh. Oh, chip on it. Nope. Oh, no, I have these similar things. These are nice. The tulip underneath, it looks like tulip. Surely I'm missing something. Oh, look at this. Oh, whoa. What did I say? Navajo, Pinto, Ellen and Tao, something. We're gonna stick. Oh, oh no, I'm not gonna remove it. I'm gonna ask them. <laughs> I don't know what. 
Oh, this is really neat. Let's grab that. That's different. <laughs> Almost removed. Four ninety nine because it's confusing me. Like, what is it? <laughs> oh my gosh! Look at this one with a little frog in the middle for two ninety nine. I don't know. <laughs> oh, I remember when Pier One did these. I remember. Where did I see these Denby England? These are so pretty. I had like a set maybe. Um, like a small little crop. Okay, what are these? Oh my gosh. $3.99, these are like with lids. Who makes those? There's two of them. There's another one, there's a smaller one. $3.99 and then this one is Oh, here. Jade Bone. Oh, let's get the, let's get these two. They're both $3.99, even though one's smaller, but I think that's really pretty. It's like a mint green. Loading up the cart. Okay, guys, I need your help here because they want $79 for a set of eight. Is there any reason why I cannot use my Google Lens? Because there's no reception back here. So if they're worth it, let me know. Look at the bottom. I'm gonna have it like this so maybe you could screenshot it. $50 back there. Let's look at it. Like I said, always willing to pay up if something is worth it. it. Says made in Romania. I do not think that's worth it. I do not think they're gonna get 150 bucks out of that. Even half of that, if that's the color that's for sale. That might be Dorothy Thorpe, but I have a lot of it with a silver rim. A lot of Dorothy Thorpe. These are cool too. They're flash, but these two, they look vintage. I don't know. I'm not going to pick up any more wine goblets. I have a lot. Well, it's not that I have a lot necessarily. It's just they're not selling. So I got to go with what is selling. Um, to Santa. It's kind of cute. Look at this. Made in China, mouth blown. Neat, and these look pretty old. Those are good, but we'll leave them. I don't want any of, any of these. They take forever to sell on my end. So I'm not finding any pictures that I like back there, except there's a picture with a, a girl on it. <laughs> look at this. $7.99 project piece. And that's just really neat. They just stuck a little girl on her on there. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Let's put it here. Maybe somebody will pick her up. There's a fresh cart with a cat. A stone cat. For $7.99. Yeah. We'll grab the cat. Let's see what else they're putting out. Oh, this is really good. I don't want to break anything. <laughs> this one. That is Noritake for $10. That may be worth it with the full set with the bottom. Um, what else? There's the big marble thing here and oops, sorry ma'am I think that is it for the fresh cards there's these bottles oh there's the federal bottles for $2.99 this is says bourbon I like it it's just $2.99 and then there's this one that says rye that's good. thank you <laughs> she'll let me get it right out of her cart all right, so the lady just handed me this, and it says two of set of two. So I think, even though it's missing two of these cups, there's four saucers. No, one, two, three, four, five, six saucers, only two cups, but it has salt and pepper shakers and this. And I think with the $9, it comes all together. These are optic. Ooh. <laughs> you know where you can get your glassware? Get your thrift shop up because that is where you're going to find it. 
to entertain people at your home, right? I, I know I'm missing stuff, but we must move on because time is of the essence. So we'll go on the other side and see what we can find. Wait, these can sell for big money at um antique markets for me. I mean, the vintage markets. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab this for $7.99. I'm gonna grab it. Yeah. Yep. These are great. $7.99, you guys. Let's see what other bat. Here you gotta look high and low. I mean, check this out. Look at this basket. Are you they kidding? This is so old. Is this broken? Yeah. Yeah. That's really nice though. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna have to come back. Look at that. Oh my. <laughs> Can you tell I'm having too much fun? It's totally helping my stress. These are good. Mm, let's look for special glazes and stuff. I hope somebody picks that up though. Adam, whoa. <laughs> look, do you, look at this old glass. What's happening? Sometimes they come here and I find nothing. Oh my gosh, look at the glaze on this thing. I just saw one sell for 30 bucks online, brown. She gave me this whole set. This is cool, you guys. That's a really cool pattern for $7.99. Doing really well today. <laughs> Adam just showed up. He was like in the car and he's like, what? <laughs> like there's so much going on in the carts. Oh, look at it. You like these? These are cute, but we have these. We have these already like that. This one's cute too. Do you guys see it? Uranium. <laughs> Is it chipped anywhere, Adam? Uh, it's chipped a little bit there, but it's really not that bad. Oh, it's chipped there too. Yeah, we can't. It's hard to resell uranium that's chipped. Too bad, huh? But still, we're on a, we're on a good, it's a good start. All right, let's see. That's a cool trivet. Oh, it's all messed up. Okay, all right, okay. Okay, so I found this. I can't, I can't look up anything, but it's $7.99. I just like the way the glass is, like very mid-century. So we're gonna pick that up. I, the reason I can't find anything is because I can't, I can't look it up because of the access to internet. It's not happening for me, so this might be Fiesta. Yeah, I don't, I don't really pick up Fiesta um, dishware. Only the vases. All right, let's look at some metals real quick. That's cool. That's a Mickey. Oh, a Mickey sugar dish for seven ninety. Sugar um, container for seven ninety nine. All right, let's keep going. Okay. What else? Is that salt glaze? Yeah. Well, something pots. It's kind of nice for five. I don't know if it goes together. It's nice. I hope someone picks that up. I just ha I have a lot of those kind of things, so I shall leave it. Um, this is kind of neat. It's very old. Embossed oval flower basket. It looks old. Made in India. This is pottery. Mm. Not entirely digging it. I have to really dig something, you guys. I'm one of those people. <laughs> right? Yeah, right, right? Like, look at my cart. <laughs> I don't know about all that. <laughs> this is probably Marip Oops. Mariposa. Oh, no, Centrum. Okay, I was wrong. Ooh, that's really ornate. Wow. $7.99. Well, you know, I think it might be like made to look like old. I don't know. All right, so we're gonna go down there and there's some baggies, but like I said, time is of the essence. So we will not be looking in the baggies unless I spot something real quick, you know? But I do always recommend to look at the baggies. These are some tumblers, some wrapped dishes, always looking for fire and light. I find them often at World Thrift. It's not really something like, you know, it'll freak out when I find it because there's just so many out there. Look at these. 
Wow. This is good. Oh, they're chipped. This one's good though. I'm gonna leave it alone. That's nice. Okay, so we've made our way over to the wooden area. And I see some things. I see a few things. Like this wooden bowl is worn, but it has a really cool design. So that tells me it's, it's also, it's very worn, but this is a cool thing here. I don't, sorry, I'm looking for the price. I don't see it. It's really badly scuffed though, but that's cool if you're just decorating. Um, all right, some things. Look at the two-tone martyr and pestle. There's like five of them. Look at Adam, check this out. She's pretty, but I'm not gonna pick her up. She's all resin. Oops, I see. I missed the totem pole. And remember when I was telling you guys totem poles are selling for me? Um, this one's a really cool one. It is resin though. It is resin, it's made in China, so. Uh, we'll leave it. It's nice though. Is that Florentine? No. There's a squirrel. And here's a cat. Um, and the little pig. Oh, look at him. He might be real horse hair. Okay. He's really kind of cool. We'll leave him though. Look at that. That's a cool basket with the tree. It's probably worth something. And this wood thing. Oh, it's written. Lorraine Angaroa. Uh, it's kind of plain. Not bad though. She might be famous for all I know. What's this? These are parrots on stone. Parrots on stone. We'll have to... Oh, it's probably got chipped chipped mouth. I don't know. I'll have to open that at the register. That's cool. It's not hedgehog. It's not wood. These are really neat. I always usually pick them up. Um, you put the key in the back and you use it as a stand. So the only one, forever entwined, my love, my heart, my one and only. For $2.99, I'll go ahead and pick that up. Um... And there's one of these back here from Bulgaria. Mm -hmm. Not interested. This is probably for holy water. Yes. Oh. Wait a minute. What is this? Wow. Oh, guys. I don't know what the price is on that. But there's like a coat or something. I'll take it up front. Um, it's really neat. This is not, is it considered a cool? No, I don't think so. Um, whatever, it's, it's cool. I'm just really bad with like sewing needlepoint, like the terms of all of that. So I'm sure someone will help me on here in the comments below. Okay, let's see. All right, there's this. Oh, look at this duck is ceramic and it's pottery. It is missing the bottom, but check it out. Oh, that's kind of cool. We'll grab him. Just need to put a bottom. Not the, did I say topper? I need to put the bottom. So I'm always looking like for Florentine stuff, but I'm not seeing any right now. Look at this guy. He's funny. Look at him. He's all broken, so. Oh, somebody made a clock out of a tin. I wonder if that's worth much. Oh, well, it's $20, so we're not gonna pick that up. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and check out. You guys, I did find, uh, as we're leaving, oh, some vintage Tupperware. Oh, look at them, it's ruined on the side. And um, normally I would pick these up, but they only sold for like $30 on Etsy for a set, and that, that set is a little ruined, so. But if you like Tupperware and you're in this area, come pick these up. All right, we're really gonna check out now. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha.